Potatoes are the unsung heroes on your dinner plate. So Rose Reisman took us to Metro for a little Potato 101. Potatoes. So you thought that we just start and finish with the white potato. This is just one kind of many. Wait till I take you through all the potatoes. We've got the white. We've got the red potatoes. These are all great for boiling and mashing and roasting. But I'm going to show you a few different things here. Have you ever seen this? This is called a purple potato. You actually cook it the same way. It's very mild in flavor, but honestly, I would use it just as a beautiful garnisher if you're entertaining. How about the baking potato? Now this we all know. We wrap it up in foil, put it on the barbecue, whatever you want. But what I like to do is bake this up in an oven or microwave, cut it in half, take out the pulp, Mix it up with some sour cream. You can mix it up with some cheddar cheese, make a Tex-Mex out of it, have an entire meal. And now the beautiful, creamy Yukon Gold. This is my favorite potato. It tastes like butter. You don't need butter in it, so I make my mashed potatoes out of this. Add a little bit of olive oil, a little bit of sour cream. This is just so creamy and delicious, you'll understand why you love it. And the most nutritious of all has to be the sweet potato bright orange flesh, lots of antioxidants, but instead of just mashing this or boiling it, you can make the best sweet potato fries, which are so trendy today. No frying, cut it up into eight, brush it with a little olive oil, maple syrup and cinnamon, bake it for 20 minutes, just fantastic.